Hello everyone, welcome back to my next tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to model this machine component using Creo parameter. While modeling this component, I will start with the left side, right side face of this, this one. I will create the sketch of this model, then I will extrude up to the length of 63. Then I will create a cut of this one. Then I will create this cut. Then I will add this material. This is a simple model. Now we will create this model using Creo parametric. Here you can see first I have created this sketch, then I have extruded, then I have created this cut, again I have created, then I have created this cut, then I have added this material. Now we will model this component using Creo parametric. Go to file, close, new, solid part. Use default template, untick this use default template, say OK. Our model in MM, so use MM part solid absolute, say OK. I'm just switching on all the planes. So for easy drawing, I'm keeping a model like this. So I'm just taking the front plane, sketch, sketch view. We can draw the center line. Now center line, I'm just creating the vertical line and horizontal line. First we'll start with the line of 75. This line has a length of 75, fit screen. Then we'll continue with the remaining lines. This has to be a vertical. Vertical constraint, this is a vertical. Now, this dimension is 50. Here, this dimension is 12. Just say OK. Extrude. Make it symmetric. The extrusion length is 63. Just say OK. Now, I have modeled this one. Then, we just want to model this one. First, we'll create this material addition feature, then we'll remove these two material removal features. So for creating this material addition feature, we just want to create a plane 19 mm from the left side surface. Select the surface plane. From here, the distance is 19. Say OK. Take this plane, sketch, sketch view. Now orientation, we can change this orientation to left, right, I want plane like this. Yes, sketch. See? Now we just want to model here. For reference, I'm just taking this and this edge as a reference. Close it. Now take a line somewhere here. Vertical. Just make it triangle. This height is 16. And uh, from here to here distance is 12. This is we just want to connect it as a perpendicular line. Just say OK, extrude, change the direction. The thick, thickness we just want to specify as 25. Say OK. Now this one we have done. Now we'll we have to remove this cut. Select the surface, sketch, sketch view. Reference these two. Just close. Here and here the distance is 25 so take a dimension from here to here it is 25 from here to here this also be a 25 and this dimension is 15 
save ok extrude change the direction to next save ok similarly here also we can make select the surface sketch sketch view here we just want to make it this one is the mid one just close it randomly just put a rectangle from here to here it's 25 22 distance is 22 from here to here it is 22 and height it has to be 12 now just say ok extrude change the direction material removal to next say ok now where from edges default orientation add all the planes now we have modeled this machine component with the simple steps thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel for more videos thank you